Hi, I'm Ryan Thompson. This is the second installment in a series on left-handed violin playing. And I'd like to start out by showing you a book that I've written and published that's called Playing the Violin and Fiddle Left-Handed. And this is a book that talks about playing violin left-handed, why you might want to do that, how you'd obtain a left-handed violin, how to convert a right-handed violin to left-handed, how to talk to luthiers who are instrument makers who may be able to build you a left-handed violin, and lots of biographical information about people who play left-handed, why they do, including concert violinists, chamber musicians, classical fiddlers, um, folk fiddlers from various different traditions, including Scottish and bluegrass and so forth. So you can read all about it in, in this book here. And what I want to do also in this series, the second of the series, is I'd like to talk a little bit about some of the mythology um, about left-handed violin playing. So one of the things that's commonly heard, people will say, left-handers have an advantage in fingering a violin with their left hand because they're left-handed dominant. And if you're left-handed dominant, that means that your left hand is a little more coordinated. Maybe you choose that hand to, to write with or to do things that require skill. So the left-hander's advantage, that means that if a left-hander plays a violin like this, it's going to be easier for them to do fingering. So they have an advantage over a right-handed player. They're going to be able to finger a little easier. But let's take a look at that, and I'll tell you why that's a myth. The reason why it's, why it's a myth is that right-handed people have the, a similar and equal advantage with their right hand. Their right hand is more coordinated. That's why you'll always see right-handed people writing with their right hand or buttering their bread, holding the knife in their right hand, and you'll see right-handed people doing lots and lots of things right-handed. And that's the reason why. is because it's a lot easier for them to do things right-handed. So. They should be able to finger a violin better with their right hand. But have you ever seen a right-handed person fingering their violin with their right-handed? No. No, they don't. They play right-handed. That means they hold their bow in their right hand, and they use their less coordinated, non-dominant hand to finger. So I think that if right-handed people were actually going to um, take advantage of the, the right-hander's advantage, they'd be fingering their violins with their right hand. And they aren't. 